There's Poncho about to go on the air with his second radio station. <laughs> radio show. Radio station show. KSJD. KICO Rico. Here we go in two minutes. It's kind of historic because it's been tough to get this thing going out of the Rico studio. And we broadcast across the four corners and it just links up and goes out across the four corners area. Awesome. The Church of Rock. That's the name of your show. Yep. Uh, <laughs> of course. Awesome. <laughs> Everybody, this is Poncho and Rico. Can you hear me out there? No, oh, no. Still got one minute. Hi everybody, this is Poncho and Rico. That's right, coming to you out of Rico. We are live up here. And you're listening to KSJT Cortez, KZET Toeyak, and KICO Rico, member-supported solar-powered dryland community radio. Did he just say that? Now broadcasting at 90.5 FM in Dove Creek, Bluff, Shiprock, and across the Four Corners area. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and on the web at ksjd.org. I think that was a little redundant there. Welcome to the Saturday night. I'm sorry, Sunday night. Welcome to the Sunday night, uh, and ap appropriately so, Church of Rock, where we're exploring rocks, gospel roots. I've got, well, you know, really a lot of classic rock that's been inspired by gospel. Then I've got a lot of rock-inspiring uh, gospel music, and all in between. I'm going to get us started tonight with contemporary uh, Ashley Cleveland, She's going to be doing a stone song, then I'll have the stones doing a gospel song. We're going to jump back and forth to Ashley as she does some different uh, gospel versions of classic rock songs, kind of juxtaposed with the classic rockers. This close to be a shame not to. It's two o'clock. Let's go for it. All right. As soon as we, you'll probably have to take off when we get back. Here. Get over there, and you got like 20 minutes to fish. <laughs> then we'll head back. Yeah. <laughs> this is about maybe two miles from here. <laughs> what a view, huh? Yeah. Okay, Pancho and I are up on a mountaintop. This is an old mining cabin. See what's left of it. It's actually quite a bit. All things considered. It's built with logs and trimmed with planks on the inside. It's got mud adobe with a little concrete veneer over the mud. There's Poncho's Jeep, another building that fell. And here's the view from this mine. That will be a very gorgeous view in about two and a half weeks when all those aspen down there turn gold and red. Waterproof up to your chin. Nice 
Thank you. 